And now I'm going to get myself a haircut. not scary. I'm a horrible driver, by the way. I've literally flipped so many cars, and it's really fucking bizarre. Oh, there's a cop right there. Hello. Nice man. Is it weird I always wave at cops, like, as if they know me or something? Well, that's great. Honk like crazy in front of a cop. That's really intelligent. Motherfucker! Hey, what about me? Yo, motherfucker! Hey, come get a haircut with me. Where are you going? Joseph Martin, you want to come? No, but I need a man to protect here. Oh, okay, well... It's my house I'll, I'll clip your toenails. Okay, Actually, I don't want to touch those things. Ooh. Oh, that's Steve Cuccio, my crazy neighbor. The one that literally never leaves my life. He's not only just the neighbor across the street, he lives in our back house. So technically, he's our tenant. Our tenant that doesn't pay rent just lives with us. I don't really know what he does either. It's kind of bizarre. I'm basically incapable of taking care of myself, so my assistant puts my pills together for me every day. And there is a lot of them in here. They have some really good shit if you want some. The pink one especially is really good. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba oh, I forgot that you guys were with me. I talk to myself quite a bit because no one else will talk to me. I wonder the more you push it, the faster if it will go. Welcome to Beverly Hills, we even have dogs here. Actually, we have a lot of dogs in Beverly Hills, but some of them come to the salon. Wait, do I need to wash my hair? It's like Lufthansa. I miss that. I've known Jane since I was a child. She used to color my hair, and my mother still didn't know I was gay. Did I ever tell you I really don't like you? You don't like anybody, but no one likes you either. No one likes me. I was just telling my audience that. I was just telling them that I have no friends. You're my friend, aren't you? Your parents. Even you're not my real friend. I'm technically paying you for your services right now. Da 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 we love musicals. From a music, we're very we're musical. very musical. He's gay and I'm just very gay. Positive. Every cloud on the brain. Now splash the puddles. Don't, 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 we found our match. Now we can go from the duo to the trio. The driver shop trio. I'm sure we can find somebody else in here to join us. Don't swing. <laughs> don't fly. Yeah, I love you, Louis. You got your Louis Armstrong in there. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think you did a good job. Is this the first time you've cut hair? <laughs> yeah. This is your first time? I used to be a retired window cleaner. Window cleaner, flight attendant. <laughs> No. And now I doing hair. <laughs> well, it has been a pleasure. A pleasure. Mwah. Mwah. Until next time. What days do you come? Ta ta. Ta ta. Fuck off. Yeah, oh my God! Yes. It's really small. It's beautiful and it's emerald cut. Some guy in the street goes, someone must really love you. And I'm like, okay, I'm flipping that around. Yeah, seriously, it depends what part of town you're in. Right here. Now flip it back around. <laughs> oh my God, it's insane. It's really beautiful, congratulations. So oh my God, I'm so excited for this wedding. Okay. It's a $20,000 bed, it's ridiculous. But... Pre-discount or post-discount? It's a, it's a $40,000 40, bed. $40,000. It's a $40,000 bed. Pre-discount. 
We won't eat for a week. <laughs> You're doing that bed for sure? No, I'm open. Like, maybe we go that raffia route with like the, the you know, the, like the sea store used to look, like the old the raffia. Cloth? Yeah, raffia. Grass cloth? Yeah, raffia. Like what's cloth. in the hallway right yeah. there? Yeah, I love that. I, I love always loved that. I had that in my room when I was growing up. My parents didn't know I was gay. It's like <laughs> literally everything my parents did not know I was gay. I was like, I want twall and I want raffia. Like, what your the fuck? Like, your what? mom's like, what? What the fuck? And they were like, I had no idea. It's like crazy to me. I love this bed. Yeah, I mean. It's just that fabric and the bedding that's making you feel Caribbean. Yeah. But the bed's so massive. It doesn't have to be in the suede room box. Even like this fabric is making you feel like it's so like. But this looks, I hate this. You hate the fabric. What's behind here? It's all leather, front and back. So well, we can make any color. No, I'm feeling, I, it can what? Be, it can be anything. No, don't leave yet, we get fabric. Do you want to pick some fabrics while I'm gone? Yeah. Yay, thank you. so much to do. <laughs> you don't need to decorate it. I was just asking you to look, look at a fabric for me, but I love it. Okay, I gotta run. Okay, I love you, because I'm making notes for you. Okay, I love you. So Josh totally j ditched me. So now we're gonna do his room for him because he always makes me do everything for him anyway. So we're just taking care of it and he'll come back and it'll be all done. All he has to do is pay, his favorite thing. I want to find like a burnt orange silk to drape in the back so we can hang a fabulous oil painting in front because he's Josh and he's having oil in his bedroom. So we'll have his oil in front. I think Josh has fabulous taste. I think his parents' home is one of the prettiest homes in LA. And I know he'll love me to say that. I think he has really excellent, eclectic and like old taste. Like in a, not in a chic way, not in like a yucky old, but like in a really elegant old. Like he's very, an old, an old soul. It's very like, Regency meets gay meets rich. That's Josh. But I love Josh. I even borrowed his grandma Edith's dress to one of his dad's parties. It was the cutest thing ever. And Edith got so mad as I altered the dress very short. And she's like, my dress was not that short when I wore it. I'm like, I'm sorry. I chopped it off, but I still have it and I cherish it so much. Okay, this is my first go. We need Josh now to get back here so we can finish. Josh will see you all very soon after he's done filming and probably having a martini. Um, and he's the best and have so much fun with him and I love him. And here we are, Natalie's Drunk Show. So I'm with Natalie Bloomingdale, one of my best friends in the world. And we are here to support her because she has this thing called The Sill and it is the most amazing website ever. It has the most incredible clothes. Hello. Hello. Hi. How do you do? <laughs> Heidi ho. No, I'm picking on things I know mom would buy. This is totally you. I don't know, you have to see in the front. It's the back, look. Here's the front, this is just the, the back. It's kind of weird that I like shopping with my mom. And I always make her buy things that I like. What's the, one, the first thing I like? You like three things. You like the skirt, you like the jacket, and you liked a blouse. Let me see those three things. Oh, oh, I've been dying to see this. <laughs> I've not seen this at all. I mean, I've seen it all. Would Betsy wear that? Would Betsy wear it? Oh my god, these sleeves. Look, Look at how beautiful. That is mom. That is really stunning. That's so cute. Um, that really is so, so cute. So cute. What? In December and November here, so cute. She's 10 pieces in already. She always comes in and does this. I don't want anything. She's already on piece number 12. Where do I get a glass precious. of wine, kids? Where is Jose? Oh, there he is. Jose. Jose. Um, a glass of wine. Yes. Okay. I was helping myself. For you. <laughs> sometimes I just like to do things myself. You know, in the polo lounge, I sometimes go in the back office and pour myself wine or take potato chips. Certainly. That's <laughs> Uncle Ricky. Hi, Uncle Ricky. Welcome. Look at this. This is so beautiful. Okay, let me take a look at this. Wow. Not a bad piece what is this, like 1,700 square feet? Yeah, it's a little over 1,000. Wow. Or is that 11,000? Fran. Hi. 
Oh my god, this place is amazing. Did I not sell you a good piece of land? Unbelievable. Yeah, it turned out look, so at well. the, look at the house we built. Well, I, I would say this is a amazing. Oh my god, look, you can see the water. Is that the water? Yeah. That's the water. Oh my god, that is so cool. And on a clear night. Wait, open it up. I want to see. Wow. Look at this thing. You always tell me you're poor. What the fuck? I am now. Oh, shit. My wife, I gave her an unlimited budget and she exceeded it. Wow. It's okay. You won't eat for like a couple weeks. <laughs> Months. Jesus Christ. Look at this thing. How great is this? Oh, it's like a Baja pool too. It is a Baja. Oh, I love that. Zero edge and Baja. Oh my God. This is so cool. So nothing can crush this, right? If you shot it with a gun, would it crack? I don't know. We're don't not going to try it. We're going to try it? Yeah, go ahead. That is really fucking cool. Hi, Thelma. Hi. What's for, what's for dinner? We're having brisket tonight? We've got, we've got two steam ovens. We've got two regular ovens. Oh, is that a fish steaming thingy? It's an everything steaming. Wow. Okay, I'll take a bite of that. Okay. What does that mean exactly, a steam oven? I don't understand. It's got steam. No, I get that. Look at my glasses. <laughs> Look, I understand that. I know what steam is. Okay, let me try this. You can let them eat out of the bowl. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Oh, my God. Might be hot. Mmm, it is moist, you're right. This is really good. Delicious. Oh, I love sea salt. This is really, really good. Can we get a beer too? For you want a beer? People. You have to come into the bar. I don't know if I have my beer. Let me check it out. Oh, 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 oh. I'm surprised it doesn't have music when, you, when it rises. Holy shit, look at that. Where did you get this thing? That's my husband's toy. I can see that. So I guess you won't be going to Europe this year. <laughs> so it's like four layers of glass, I guess? Or is it one big one? No, it's four. Four layers. So pretty. This is little Liana's. Oh, you're a little sweet, I see. She's got the You've got the best view, shit. Oh, these are automatic too? Are all of them automatic? Yeah! yeah. Every single window? Every no. Door? single one that opens. Holy shit, that is so cool. Why are you so grumpy today? I'm not grumpy. You seem grumpy. Why am I grumpy? Because usually you're funny and you're not entertaining me. <laughs> Tonight's not a great night, but you can see forever. Catalina, Palos Verdes. The, uh, the boats there and all the planes coming in and out, you can see. Yeah. Can you see Brentwood Country Club? No. On a clear night, you can see the glistening of the water, you can see the cargo ships. It's amazing. It's unbelievable. Um, Josh. Yes, dear. you remember. Yes, my darling. In the old house. Yes. I told my husband I wanted to downsize and have a view. Yeah, I'm sure that was ever going to happen. <laughs> Not a chance. This. He always thinks numbers. You can't utilize a lot efficiently without building maximum square footage. Wow, it just I sounded really smart. Me. I thought he just did it for me because he loved me. Not a shot. He's thinking about his pocketbook. Yeah. Hypothetically, mm -hmm. we want 27. No, not 27. Okay, sorry. 35. Uh, any pockets cheap? 35 mil. Yeah. It's okay, Josh. I'll say 40. Fuck you. <laughs> So what is this? What is this for? What do you? It's a vlog. We're doing a, a vlog. We're doing yeah on YouTube. So instead of just the show, it's anything I, 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 I can just do whatever I want. Like nothing. I could be taking a shit. <laughs> I feel yeah, literally. I could just do. Be well, people that. want no. want to see that. I mean, yeah. you know, it's funny. Sometimes I take photos and send it to really close friends. And you know, guys are always comparing like who's bigger. You know? No, you don't do that. <laughs> no, no. Talk about the weather. Um, okay. I'm I'm deeply thrilled. And I really, really don't know what to say because this is so okay. Hi, I'm Fran Solomon, and I'm the founder of HealGrief.org. Hi, I'm Rick, and I don't do much. <laughs> Josh had a little habit of running around seeing who died so he could run around and get their property and listing. And he didn't even let the uh, ambulance leave. He was there. He didn't wait till the body was even lukewarm. He went out and had him sign a listing because he's a great broker, right? I can't believe my mom let Josh and a whole camera crew come in my room. And it's a good thing you didn't have your underwear all over the floor. I don't want that in. <laughs> I want to 